right my family you have been so awesome to me and i am grateful i am thankful i so appreciate every moment that you have spent with me that you have spoken up for me spoken with me shared with me um wrote a comment for me read all the comments i i returned i am so thankful there's so much to be thankful for so last night i had oxtails for dinner I had some of what was here i had a dinner but i had just a half of it today i'm doing my grilled chicken salad because there's a story behind this i ordered it yesterday before i knew there was oxtail in the kitchen for my dinner and something happened with their system so the order didn't go through, but it was paid for. So when I called, they told me that, just tell them what time today um, I would like it. And so they did. I called and they just brought it. So that's my chicken salad. It's very healthy. I mean, it's, it's, a, good, it's a good salad. But today, as I promised, is my last day to have meat for now. I'm going to take a, a, a long break from meat and just go back to my fish and my vegetables. So got my cabbage, my vegetables. Those tomatoes are from the garden outside. And my celery sticks. And those are yum yum good in soup. I don't eat peanuts, but they're good with peanut butter. I do like them with the ranch dressing, salad dressing, so I won't be starving. I will still be having good foods, healthy foods, but I won't be missing much. So that salmon is for tomorrow's dinner. I'm going to be baking that again, and that will last for two days. And then I'll go back to my cabbage. We have Kalalu frozen and my mixed vegetables. So just continue to lift me up and encourage me as I continue on this journey because it has been a successful journey. I am so thankful I started out and I didn't rush into it. I took it one day at a time and didn't have any huge unrealistic expectations. But I feel good. I feel uplifted. I feel just good from inside out. I, I, there are a couple of days, you know, there are some days when you feel a little like, oh, but it has been a rewarding, rewarding journey. I would have done it again um, because I didn't have any overwhelming cravings. I just took my time and just learned to ignore things. I'm so thankful even on my table we still have chocolate over three months sitting there and this never used to happen so people believe in yourselves start moving i dance a lot dancing uplifted me it gives me that that kind of a good feeling inside i sing with the songs that i've chosen to dance to and so it i never felt lacking you know and then you find positive people in your life who it's not about complaining and 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 just miserable but people who always see the good and and when there's a discussion there's no judgments there are no judgments people you know find one person in your life who will do that for you and with you and you're going to find that you, you start having that longing to do well because you know that there's somebody there to uplift you. So again, my last day for meat. And so this is what it's going to be. This will be my dinner. It's a big salad, so you can eat all of it at once. So it will go in half and part of it will be now. And part of it will be maybe six o'clock this evening. And another thing I want to try to do is also to not eat after seven. I want to just get to that point where I might have a cup of tea, but no crackers. <laughs> I like crackers with my tea. 
But I want to get to that point. But little by little, bit by little bit. So I'm grateful for the inches I've lost. I'm so thankful. I feel so great when I could pull skirts on that I never wore for so long. And they're fitting. And so fitting is not just pulling up, but to be able to button them. So God is good, guys. And if you start, believe me, make up your mind and you'll see that the outcome will be totally, totally rewardingly, fulfillingly, enrichingly, completely, completely awesome. Just total awesomeness. So start your journey, whatever it is, and enjoy the journey. Don't let anyone take away your joy, but find people who can help you enjoy it more. All right, so take care, people. Love, love, love you all. And when I say I love you and appreciate you, know that I mean it from the heart. And um, stay well. Stay blessed because you all are blessed. You're beautiful. And go forth doing good, letting your light shine so that God, people can see your good work and glorify the God who is in heaven, who has been supplying all your needs, guiding you along your pathway, and just being there to listen when you need to talk. So if you can't be good, be careful, but walk good. As I get ready to start walking back into my vegetable and fish diet, I pray and please lift me up in prayer that I will continue to lose more pounds, more inches, and pounds and or inches both great but something will work as i continue to walk more and just enjoy life more today i saw something on one of my um jln family's page she's also part of my page part of my family where she says just live life without regrets it's just a thought for me because i never thought like that i just thought to be cautious and to be <laughs> And she says, live life. You know, sometimes we, we do these things and we sacrifice so much and we live so cautiously and we, 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 we don't want to cross certain lines. And sometimes I'm just saying, live life and live it without regrets. Enjoy what you do, but live your life. So that's something I'm thinking, you know, I'm like, okay. Not gonna jump out there, but live your life without regrets. Take care, my people. Be good to yourselves. If you can't be good, just be careful. But go live your life.